So there's the hedge there. We're taking a little bit off the sides, cleaning up the top a little bit. You can see down the side there. Not too bad. Should be uh, pretty quick and easy to handle. Have the Milwaukee Fuel Quick Lock uh, trimmer there with the articulating hedge trimmer attachment. And then the standalone uh, handheld uh, hedge trimmer. Just going to uh, put some lubricant on the blades. The blades are all dirty. I used this yesterday. So kind of like when I'm uh, edging a sidewalk with the line trimmer, I like to use a three point uh, hold on uh, this smaller hedge trimmer. So what I tend to do if I'm doing something like this here, is I'll put the battery up against my body, put my hand on the trigger, and then I've got three points of contact on the trimmer and it helps me just keep it steady and straight while I'm uh, trimming the side. So there's the first section done on the end there, looking pretty good. I'll come back after I've done all the sides to uh, touch up the top using the uh, longer extension pole version. And See, I'm just following the contours of the hedge. There's uh, no way to make this completely flat or straight. You can see all those uh, dips and valleys. You'd be taking off way too much and just cutting, you know, right into uh, the hedge there. The greenery is just on the outside. So we're just trimming it, following all those contours to clean it up. So as you can see, I'm doing like a bulk sort of edit, just uh, taking off the majority of the heads, trimming it up. I get through that all the way down. Like I said, I'll grab the uh, larger uh, quick lock system to uh, touch up the top. And then I'll go over the hedge again and just touch up any areas that need to be uh, reassessed.
but now it's time to grab the uh, quick lock version of the hedge trimmer and uh, start doing that top edge uh, to round it over uh, into the top and just uh, clean up uh, that portion there. So let's get to it. And then once that's done, just following the contours, essentially you're just riding the blade edge on top of the uh, hedge there. So it's just cutting that new growth. And then I take the blade, straighten it back out. And then I'm just going to feather the edges here, cutting off that sharp edge. I'm kind of rounding it. Okay, so you can see uh, we've done uh, the majority of the hedge there. Got that uh, initial uh, trimming all done. Got the top uh, rounded and blended in. Now I just go back and do some touch-ups. So you can see, like along the bottom here, where there's some still some uh, little rough areas there. So I'll go through the whole entire hedge and. Uh, touch up any areas that need to be touched up. Okay, so all done with the uh, hedge here. Take it around the end. There's the finished end right there. Feathered in the top. See along the sides here. Looking nice and tidy. that in there. 